Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm really glad to see you again. My name is Jill Moa and I create a lot. I'm doing hair, makeup, accessories, clothes, everything you need to do to come up with a beautiful portrait. First of all, thank you so much again for tuning in for my another photography adventure. Thank you for you being here, for all of your likes, share, subscribe, repost, and let's start. My latest pictures was really colorful, they have a lot of glamorous effects and to mix this up I really want to create something more like mysterious and dark and edgy. So I want to have this like more black and white palette with maybe a little bit of touch of color and I want to have this like really dramatic light. So basically this is the inspiration. First of all, I need a clothes and I get this like an amazing cotton t-shirt and it's black and white and I want to have not only this like color contrast, I want to have a fabric contrast. So I ended up to having this like arganza, it's like very voluminous and it's a nice contrast to my cotton shirt. So I have this like double thread, it's like contrast in the colors and contrast in the fabric. So for this one I cheat a little bit, I already had a t-shirt that I bought, I just cut actually all of the sleeves and then I create the new one, I use the ribbon to have more volume in the sleeve and I just saw everything with the sewing machine, so actually it was one of the simplest but yet still impressive design I ever done. Next thing is accessories. I always start with the earrings and lately I had a lot of fun with the design. I ended up to having these like two forms. I added up to pigment, so I have this like nice fog dramatic effect. And I also use the wire to wrap it up my earrings to have this like more uh, commercial and production feel to this. My next accessory is a glove. Basically it's just a party glove of this like very cheap black leather, but I use a white thread to come up with design and it's turned out very beautiful. Working with design requires a lot of precision and patience. Unfortunately, I have none of these two qualities, but I like actually working with the color pigment and I like creating the design, but the rest was kind of less interesting. Uh, then I use a wire to create this like of the laps of my earrings then first of all i need to get my simple glove because unfortunately party gloves come in this like very strange design then i use the white thread and this was very very time consuming but it's looking cool my model name is Azura and they have very short bob and also bleached eyebrows and I want to extend this look even more with this like very dark uh, smoky eyes. I started with a black and grey colors but then I decided to add like more color in. Also I really want to have this like peekaboo skin effect so I had this like heart shaped sticker I just cut it glue it and this is how I created like my heart shape form here Working with Azura was a blast, we already worked before, so we have a lot of things to chat about. I done the hair first, I styled everything. I think if I could travel back in a time machine, I would style the bangs a little bit different, but I'm so happy with the eyes and the makeup in general, and now actually I'm really thinking about bleaching my eyebrows too, because it looks fantastic, isn't it? So the background, I have this like dark deep background and uh, because I want to have a harsh light, I use this like very strong light. Unfortunately, I think it's not very comfortable to model around this kind of light, but Azura is a professional, they did everything amazing, so it's turned out so good. The actual shoot is kind of stressful for me because there's a lot of things to take into the consideration but uh, in the moment everything looks so perfect and I was so happy. In the post-production my main focus was the light because it's a harsh light, it's very strong and very direct and it was giving my model Azura more skin texture that they have in real life. So my main focus was to 
smooth the skin and also unfortunately my gray background wasn't wide enough and I also need to fix it. The end result is amazing. I like the pictures a lot. They like very moody, very dark. Azure looking amazing. Clothes are looking also fabulous. This is everything I dreamed about these pictures. This is the end of my YouTube video. Thank you so much again for tuning in. Please like, leave a comment, repost. Also, if you can, please subscribe to my Patreon. Your donation will mean a lot to me. And I hope I will see you next Tuesday.